eventful. Eye-opening. Enlightening. New. Uh, enlightening. Ever since I was a little girl, every time anything happened ever, I would record it or take pictures. And it got to a point where my dad would yell at me every time I took his camera. So eventually he bought me one and it just started from there. Teamwork is hard. It, it's hard being part of a group. It's kind of like, it's, it's very hectic. You don't get a lot of things done, but it's fun and rewarding in the end. I took a few years of photography in high school, digital and film, and I feel like I learned a lot there, so there's not too much new this year, but there is some things that I would have never learned had I not come here. Like filming and stuff like that's always been like an interest to me since I was a kid. I kind of like that kind of stuff. You know, just messing around with the camera, and so, I don't know, I'm at that stage in my life where I'm not really sure what I want to do for a career, so I figured why not I'll give it a shot. At the time, it was I was leaning more towards it because I was I was trying something else and that didn't really work out for me, and so I figured I'd try something completely different. And this is different than most courses you would take. Yeah, definitely learned a lot about. I mean, filming like aperture, all that exposure, all that kind of stuff. I've learned a lot. Yeah. A lesson I've learned from this program is time management. Definitely time management, that's been an ongoing issue for me. I was never really interested in photography, but I was definitely interested in video. I always liked making music videos and just like playing around with different camera effects. And I liked to say that I was, I liked editing a lot, but now I've realized that I actually don't know a lot about video editing, but that's something that I really liked to do. And so yeah, I just looked for a program that just kind of catered to that. I've liked all the classes that I've taken so far. Even the photography classes that we took first year, I actually really um, liked them. They taught me a lot. I actually got a photography job this past summer working at a camp. So if I didn't take any of the photography classes first year, I wouldn't have learned any of that stuff. It makes you versatile. It helps you in the photography area and the video area. You need to find people who have the same mindset as you and stick with them because otherwise you're going to be stuck alone doing your projects by yourself with, or with people who you don't get along with. For me, it's, a, it's sort of an added skill set that I'm looking at uh, attaining. Like I'm a graphic designer by trade and I'm finding that it's a little bit harder to get to work just in that. So I'm just, just as something else that I can offer clients. More and more online media is needed for, and it's sort of the convergence from print media going on to online media. And I just wanted to sort of migrate to that also. My favorite class was probably lighting first year, at least so far. Uh, uh, just because I really enjoyed the theory behind lighting and the different types of light, the intensity, why is lighting important? When can you use it? How often, et cetera. There's, there's many different factors to lighting and I didn't realize how big of a component it was in video capture until that class. And uh, it was just such a, a breath of fresh air for me to see something that interesting. I think some of my favorite teachers was my first year photography teacher, Jennifer Bedford. And she taught me really well. I also really enjoyed Mark Watton. I had him for editing. Uh, he's really cool, he's got a lot of good personal stories and he made me realize that video and film and everything isn't that far out to reach, like it, it all starts at places like Durham. Durham College gives you the uh, foundation and the basics that you need to uh, decide where you want to go or what uh, avenues you want to explore after graduation, whether it be shooting corporate videos or independence or weddings. You're not going to walk out of the school and be a feature film director. You're going to come out and know that maybe that's the path I want to take so I can take the skills that I learned and apply them someplace else. The way the course is structured is beneficial because you get a taste of everything. You get editing, you get lighting, you get sound design, you get some capture work you understand photography as well. That I think will make you a better and more rounded producer of content after uh, graduating or leaving Durham College.